so hi everyone how are you all doing i hope you're having a fabulous day welcome to discovery natural channel so if this is your first time please feel free to click the subscribe button because i am as real as real can be so i was doing my facebook live um and people were asking questions about to grow their hair and then i got a message from someone so you can of course you can dm me on facebook Discovery Natural or even on Instagram Discovery Natural and we'll chat back and forth So someone a young lady contacted me and she said that she is in her early 40s And she wanted to know how to stop this grain. I hear just that a grain and she wanted to know how to stop it so i i thought about it and i was like well a lot of people ask me that question people even ask me do i dye my hair this is my hair um i do not dye my hair and i'll give you some tips that i use in terms of my own grain history so first thing first if you're grain early and people in your family gray early it could just be the way genetically it is and with that being said it is a bit hard for you to slow that down okay you could change some other stuff in your diet you could change some other factors in your health that i will tell you about but it can be a little bit hard to stop that so but if you're someone that you just started growing and you want to slow it down of course there's some things i've written it down that you can do with a lot of research every time when i suggest things for you to do please just like when you go to church and the pastor says this and that and that you thou shall not thou shall you go back to the bible read it so if any youtuber comes and tells you do this do that please do your research don't go for their word don't go for my word always do your research but i'll always tell you what has helped me a lot my age is 45. I am 45 going on to 50. I just love to say that. <laughs> and as people say, somebody told me that I am cheating God. Um, no, I'm not cheating God. A couple of things that are helping. So let me go back to step number one. One of the things, let me just, I'm just going because I posted it out. If you're not following me on Facebook, you are missing out because all this stuff, uh, my Facebook people already know what I'm talking about. So the first thing is, the gray hair could be caused from genetic. We've talked about that. The next thing is you could include some things in your diet. One thing that I include in my diet is molasses. Molasses is really good in terms of improving the iron levels, improving, improving the circulation of the blood flow, all those things. Magnesium is in um, molasses, copper, molasses, a lot of ingredients are in molasses. So molasses is something that you can just add into your teas. Um, just go slow by slow and incorporate it internally. You can also use it in your hair externally. I make this amazing molasses hair mask that I use once in a while. I'll use it. I'm not using a while, but once in a while, if I want to, it's really good. It's like almost like a caramel treatment and you put it in your hair. You Use it frequently and you see the grain changing into this copper looking thing after a couple of months some people would take like six months for this to happen but it does work and i've seen it work in my own hair and also another thing that you can do is you can incorporate oils so there are some oils that you can incorporate that actually are known to prevent premature grain number one rosemary oil rosemary oil is a powerful essential oil so please when you make the oil also i always add rosemary oil in mine always put a few drops so like a bottle like this i'll put like 10 drops of rosemary oil other oils that you can include are argan oil argan oil um amla oil amla oil has been known to be an excellent oil we'll talk about amla oil later you can also include castor oil castor oil also is known for that black seed oil i consume black seed oil whenever i feel a little bit sick what whatever i'll consume black seed oil sometimes i will add black seed oil into my hair oil so black seed oil you can add that now you can always look in the description area where i put a list of all these oils that I use and you can get them. Black seed oil is not a cheap oil. If you find a black seed oil that is very cheap, it is not pure. Just know that. Uh, sage oil is also a good oil. Thyme oil. 
and sandalwood and chamomile oil. The last five, I've never tried them before, but research shows that they have agents that can actually help against the free radicals, against the things that causes premature grain. Lavender oil is one oil that I also add in. Um, I just, I haven't bought it in a while because I finished it, but lavender oil is really good. Please always dilute essential oils with a carrier oil. They are potent, so you don't want to just take it and slather like rosemary oil all over your hair, please. It can cause great damage to your hair. Next, you can also incorporate Ayurvedic herbs. Herbs such as amla powder, aloe vera powder, briny powder, which is an excellent powder. Take curry leaves, soak curry leaves or infuse your curry leaf into like castor oil. You can dry up your curry leaf and just use it into a powdery form, mix it with your deep conditioner, your hot oil treatments. You can also use fenugreek and also um, um, henna. Now with henna, it could color your hair. So be very mindful about using henna in your hair because it's color so when you use henna which i have used the powder in a powder mixture i actually use an ayurvedic herb that comes with all these herbs in it and then what i do is that it comes in a pack uh you can look in the description area i also have a coupon code for that and um discount information for that so you can always use that but it's a mixture of ayurvedic herbs so the two ways that i use that ayurvedic herb is i'll take the ayurvedic herb i could mix it with my deep conditioner and use it when i'm deep conditioning my hair let it sit for 30 minutes or even 45 minutes and then wash off in all the things that you do, when it comes to premature grain, slowing it down, I have just about three gray hair. One is embedded in here. One you cannot see, it. it's really tiny. I don't even know if you can see, and then there's one somewhere over here. I don't know if you can see it. It's to be pre, always consistent. Anything that you do, if you want to find good result, you have to be consistent. Don't just do something just for, oh, I'm going to do it one week. Oh, these grades are still coming in. Oh, do it one month. Oh, these grades are still coming in. Be consistent. Use them over and over and over again. Some results you might see them after three months. Some results you might see after six months. It all depends on your consistency and your body. The last thing I want to talk about, and please stay and watch this, you have to remove the triggers that causes premature grain. A lot of us, we get premature grain because of number one, stress. Women of our age, in our 40s, we are at that age, if we have children, our children are teenagers, we're going through, trust me, I have teenagers, I have 13 year old and 16 year old, the stress level can be like, whoo, some days. You have to find ways to manage those stress. So key ways you can use to manage the stress, yoga. Yoga is really good for managing the stress. Also, um, you can also use exercising. Exercising reduce, re reduces stress level by releasing some endorf uh, endorphins in your body. I knew I was going to mess that up. Endorphins in your body. Meditating. Mm. Listening to music. And just taking yourself out. If something is going to stress you out, you know, in our language, Yoruba, they'll say, you know, if a child is stressing the mother's out, they say, ah, oh, le kwami, yami o kwami. Meaning that you cannot kill me. My mother didn't kill. I didn't kill my mother. You know? So you have to remove, look for, take a walk. Tell your family, you know what, today, can you just give me 10 minutes? Just use that time and breathe. Stress can cause you to overly exert yourself and cause the grain to happen. Now, those are the aspects I want from to let you guys know. If you guys have any tips or things that you've used that has worked, the comment area is all yours. Don't forget to subscribe. My name is Shola and this is Discovery Natural. Join me on Facebook every Monday through Friday, every single day from around 6, 6.30 and ask your questions. I'll see you in another live. Thank you. And don't forget to watch this, please. It's there for you. And you can also visit our family channel and um, join us there. Thank you so much and I'll see you in another video. Thanks for watching. Bye.